So today the girls have had a big day of um, surfing analysis this morning and also training. So they've had some snacks down the beach, but for this afternoon we've prepared a, a traditional Peruvian dish. But anyway, you know, you travel, we're, we're always near the ocean, we're, we're in playing in and around the ocean, so, you know, fish is the, is the perfect way to balance out that, that balance of either proteins and carbs and, and fresh nutritional veggies. And... We have just came back from, from surfing, from training, and everybody's hungry now, so I think I'm going to eat some fruit, because we're having ceviche. My favorite Peruvian dish is ceviche. It's super cool to be able to teach some of the girls how to cook ceviche. Okay, girls, this is the first time making a ceviche, right? Yes. It's very simple. There was a really good chef that came and teached us. Ceviche is the most typical play of Peru and it's our pride. The key of the ceviche is that the, the fish is very fresh and we have this, this kind of lime. Our lime is more uh, strong or sour. We have this very fresh fish. This I caught it this morning. Are <laughs> <laughs> you got good skills? Well, I was shaking. You have to be disappointed. Salt, chili, onion, lemon juice, cilantro, and pepper. And then we mix it. Easy, huh? It's pretty. We call it this tiger milk. Wow, this is gonna be amazing. Can we? Oh. Yeah. <laughs> I'm like, Which okay. One do I want. I think it's um, a really healthy option to eat after you surf. Good for you. It's like you know, fresh fish. It'll really, uh, it's a good hit of protein as well to um, help your muscles recover. So definitely a good option. A food that you should have after surfing, I think. Oh, it's a good Cheers. 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 It's not quite like a drink, but cheers.